Fans of the CW's Batwoman will be disappointed to learn that Ruby Rose has unexpectedly bowed out of the title role of Kate Kane. The parting from the show appears to be perfectly amicable, as Rose's announcement includes a long thank you to her director and producers for the opportunity. Nonetheless, she seems to feel walking away is best for her future. It's not as though the show has performed poorly. Batwoman's premiere season punched in a comparable weight class to more established shows in the cable network's Arrowverse lineup, ending up as the network's third most-watched program of 2019. The news of the lead actor's departure is surprising and even upsetting, but it's not all bad. With the recent announcement from the CW that the network plans to delay virtually all new season premieres until at least January 2021, Batwoman's producers will have plenty of extra time to seek out a new lead. Lending further comfort, the press release confirming Rose's departure additionally included a reassurance that the channel is still dedicated to finding another LGBTQ actress to fill the role of the canonically lesbian hero. But why did Ruby Rose exit the role so suddenly, when everything seems to be going just the way any television actor would want? Well, there are a number of possible reasons. I'm not asking you to be a hero. I'm just asking you to keep going. going. Back in the summer of 2019, Rose had to have emergency surgery due to herniated discs in her spine that threatened to paralyze her. This is your spine. You, you, it's, two of your discs have herniated and they've broken all the protective layers. You have like this tiny amount that your spine is like not severed. The injury was sustained at some point during the filming of Batwoman's first season, and over time, as Rose began to experience numbness in her extremities, realization set in that the injury might be much more serious than at first believed. She didn't reveal this fact until that September, well after the surgery, and as far as anyone is publicly aware, she has indeed recovered just fine from her injury. Variety reports an anonymous source that claims Rose departing the role has nothing to do with her health, but it's difficult to say exactly what that means. She's probably perfectly healthy now, since doctors intervened before the injury could become permanent, but it may have affected her strength and flexibility in a way that prevented her from fully recovering in time for filming. It's not necessarily that she's unhealthy, but there could be uncertainty around how safe it is to continue performing such a stunt-heavy role after a spine injury, even a healed one. It's also entirely possible that the injury has simply brought Rose to second-guess her dedication to the role. Anyone would question how willing they are to continue working a job after getting so seriously hurt on site, even when there's no one at fault. The aforementioned network-wide delay of new content on the CW, alternatively, may have provided Rose an opportunity she may have been looking for. In an interview with Glamour in September 2019, shortly before the revelation of her spinal injury, Rose confessed to feeling homesick for her native Australia, and that she had an interest in pursuing future roles closer to home. Television work in America necessitates keeping a part-time home in LA and living there at least during the filming season, though it's beneficial to remain during all the required press tours as well. When you consider that TV pre-production and filming can take up almost half the year on its own, and that Australia is thousands of miles away, it would be extraordinarily difficult to spend much time back in Australia while playing a principal role in a sprawling superhero television franchise like the Arrowverse. She has also been open about past struggles with her mental health, so it's understandable that being closer to home might help her feel more grounded. Whatever the reason for Rose's departure, she's entirely allowed to walk away, especially in circumstances so unprecedented that a whole television network has shifted its release schedule. Rose has no publicly announced project that she's gravitating towards instead, not that she would need to have one to justify her decision. Wherever she shows up next, we'll certainly be excited to see her again. I will protect my city. No, you won't. Cause you're done. Get out. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about your favorite movies and TV shows are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.